Alaska is the largest state in the United States, spanning 586,000 square miles of land, which is over twice the size of Texas. However, it also holds the title as the third least populated state with just over 730,000 people, which for perspective is about how many people live in Denver. Except the thing is, Alaska is over 3,800 times bigger than Denver. Additionally, over the last 10 years, Alaska's population has basically stayed stagnant, with some years gaining a few people and other years losing a few people. So, today on Across the Globe, we're going to explore the shocking reasons for why people won't move to Alaska. Number 1. High Cost of Living With its vast and awe-inspiring wilderness, Alaska is often considered one of the most beautiful places to live, and the rugged landscape and diverse wildlife attract adventurers and nature enthusiasts alike. However, despite its allure, a substantial reason that prevents people from moving to Alaska is its high cost of living. Everything from daily necessities like groceries to housing and transportation tends to be more expensive than other states due to its remote location and harsh climate. For example, in your state, claims that no matter where you go in the state, the cost of living isn't cheap. With that said, State Explora also listed high cost of living as one of their 10 reasons not to move to Alaska. They stated that the cost of living in Alaska is one of the highest in the United States, noting that due to Alaska being such a remote state, a large portion of its items must be shipped in, which drives up prices considerably. In addition, State Explora stated that the high cost required to heat fuel means that Alaskans have to pay more for their energy. What's more, a large number of occupations in Alaska are seasonal or situated in rural locations leading to lower salaries. This makes keeping up with the higher cost of living difficult for many households. In April 2023, AP News reported that out of the state's roughly 735,000 residents, around 13% of residents received Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program benefits, better known as SNAP. However, there's more. In 2023, Forbes stated that Alaska had the highest food prices and healthcare costs out of any other state, and Wise Voter ranked it fifth for its cost of living index, not including DC. Number two, shipping problems. In today's technological world, whatever we want is pretty much available at the click of a mouse or a tap on our smartphones. However, in Alaska, things are a little behind in that department. Due to its remote location, Alaska struggles with shipping problems, making it expensive and time-consuming to transport goods and supplies to remote communities and rural areas. The state's infrastructure is limited, and major highways and railways do not extend to the far reaches of the state. As part of their 10 reasons not to move to Alaska, State Explorer placed shipping problems near the top. They noted that the state's high shipping costs and scarcity of infrastructure has created severe shipping problems. They stated that goods that are shipped into Alaska have to travel a long way, which inevitably ramps up the cost. As a result, businesses, families, and individuals can struggle to obtain basic goods. Furthermore, with such high demands for goods and services, shipping companies often struggle keeping up. For example, in October 2023, Alaska Public reported that FedEx has been struggling to keep up with the shipping needs of certain Alaskan towns. In addition to what we already mentioned, another key reason for such problems is the weather. In fact, Carlisle Logistics noted in May 2022 that Alaskan residents face logistical challenges that are not seen anywhere else, noting that the most obvious challenges with shipping in Alaska are the weather conditions. Number 3 high crime rate. In October 2023, Travel Safe Abroad compiled a list of 18 pros and cons of living in Alaska. Number six on their cons list was the fact that there is a high crime rate in Alaska. Well, to be more blunt, Alaska actually has the highest rate of crime out of any other state in the entire country, with a rate of 837.8 incidents per 100,000 people. Alongside the issue of a higher cost of living than the average state, Alaska also has a growing drug problem, both of which are major factors in the state's gradually increasing crime rate 
which affects many individuals and communities. The high cost of living makes it difficult for people to sustain their livelihoods. As a result, drug use and drug dealing have become more prevalent. Unfortunately, drug abuse often leads to an increase in crimes such as theft, violence, and property damage. Moreover, drugs have also contributed to high rates of domestic abuse and mental health issues. As a result, Alaska has one of the highest crime rates in the country, affecting the state's reputation and the quality of life for its residents. State Explora listed drug abuse problems as one of the 10 reasons not to move to Alaska, reporting that the National Institute on Drug Abuse estimates that substance abuse costs Alaskan taxpayers more than $1 billion every year. Number 4. The Weather as we mentioned, the weather in Alaska can cause significant problems and not just with shipping. There's no doubt about it. Alaska is known to be a tough climate due to its harsh weather conditions. The state is the northernmost part of the United States, and it faces severe cold temperatures for a majority of the year. The winter season is especially difficult with average daytime temperatures ranging from 5 to 30 degrees Fahrenheit, according to Alaska Collection. Furthermore, Strong and frigid winds often blow across the state, making the already cold temperatures feel even more bitter. Out of State Explorer's 10 reasons not to move to Alaska, the weather came in near the top of the list, noting that the weather in Alaska is unpredictable and harsh. They also stated that weather can change rapidly and residents have to be ready for all kinds of conditions such as rain, snow, sleet, and hail. So, it is easy to see why the weather could deter someone from moving to Alaska. Realistically, when people decide to relocate, chasing warmer weather is often one of the top reasons, especially for those looking to retire in a more idealistic climate. However, in case it wasn't obvious, Alaska and warm are rarely found in the same sentence. According to Wise Voter, Alaska is the coldest state in the USA, with an average temperature of 30.7 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 23.5 degrees lower than the national average of 54.2 degrees. Furthermore, Alaska Travel reported that the lowest temperature ever recorded in Alaska was negative 79.8 degrees Fahrenheit at Prospect Creek on January 23, 1971. Number 5. Shifts from darkness to light. On top of its distinction for extreme weather conditions, Alaska is also renowned for its periods of complete darkness and complete light. During the winter months, some areas in Alaska experience full days of complete darkness. This can lead to depression, a lack of energy, and a vitamin D deficiency for many people living there. In fact, the National Library of Medicine reported that those living in northern latitudes are more susceptible to vitamin D deficiencies and noted that Alaska Native children may be at higher risk to develop rickets. On the opposing side of the scale, during the summer months in Alaska, some areas experience full days of complete light. While this may seem like a dream for some, it can wreak havoc on a person's sleep cycle and disrupt their natural rhythms. In May 2022, MoveHub listed 21 things to know before moving to Alaska. Second on their list, they stated that daylight hours are extreme, noting that depending on the location, people can go days, weeks, or even months without any daylight. For example, they reported that every year after the sun sets in November, the people of Utqiagvik, the northernmost town in the United States, endure a polar night and subsequently don't see the light of day for two months following. Places like Anchorage will have more normal days. However, the people there still experience unusual periods of light and dark. Number 6. Complicated Travel Alaska is notorious for its difficult travel system due to a multitude of reasons. One of the main reasons is the fact that many towns are only accessible by plane or boat. This creates challenges for travelers because they have to rely on the availability of flights or boats and weather conditions can often disrupt travel plans. Additionally, the cost of transportation can be quite high as airlines and boat companies may charge inflated prices due to the limited competition. In May 2022, MoveHub listed 21 things to know before moving to Alaska. 
Their 14th point was the fact that the road systems in Alaska are very basic. They stated that the majority of Alaska is uninhabited wilderness, with just 20% of the state being accessible by road. They also noted that transport options within Alaskan cities are reasonable. However, once you travel to rural areas, they become fairly sparse. Lastly, they added that traveling by car can be difficult in Alaska because there are only 12 numbered highways in the state. A prime example of this being Juneau, the state capital, which has no outside road connectivity and can only be reached by plane or sea. Furthermore, in Travel Safe Abroad's pros and cons of living in Alaska list, they noted that travel can be complicated in Alaska, stating that for many residents, private planes are the best way to travel to other parts of the state. Number 7. Natural Disasters and Dangers We have already established that Alaska's natural beauty is undeniable. However, beneath this allure is a harsh and unforgiving environment that can pose extreme danger to life. The state experiences extreme weather conditions with temperatures regularly dropping below freezing and heavy snowfall causing treacherous driving conditions. Furthermore, the wilderness is abundant with wildlife, including moose, bears, and wolves, which can be a deadly threat. In Travel Safe Abroad's list of the pros and cons of living in Alaska, they stated that Alaska has the second most accidental deaths of any state in the U.S., falling closely behind Mississippi. They credit many of these deaths to the harsh cold weather and from exposure to carbon monoxide due to faulty heaters or chimneys. They also noted that while Alaska's location provides many amazing benefits, there are some cons such as the risk for earthquakes and volcanic eruptions. They stated that while most are mild, there is always the potential for them to get bad. What's more, they also stated that there have been a number of moose and bear attacks. According to AZ Animals, Alaska has accounted for over 29.6% of all fatal bear attacks in the United States. They noted that Alaska is home to an estimated 30,000 grizzly bears, 100,000 black bears, and between 4,000 and 7,000 polar bears. With a population of approximately 735,000 people, this works out to nearly one bear for every five people. What about the worst states to live in America in 2024? 